Thank you so much. My name is Natalie Delap. We are here with the campaign to suspend Measure S, and we were joined here by almost 300 people, farmers and community industry members and supporters. Okay, that's a big turnout. That's it really a big is. So what we're specifically asking is for our supervisors to forgive the October 15th payment, to waive the upcoming March 15th payment, and then we are asking the supervisors to suspend Measure S payments for a full year, during which time our community can come together and develop a new, fair, and equitable tax structure that works for both the industry as well as the community. Okay, thank you for that. What kind of feedback do you have from the supervisors, either individually or I don't know. None? I don't. I, yeah, I haven't had communication with them specific to date. Okay. So what, what, what we need is to have an open public discourse at a Board of Supervisor hearing. And I understand that there will be a hearing the first week of February, which is when we will actually be able to hear what our supervisors think and believe can be done. Okay, thank you. So we're looking forward to that February meeting at the Board of Supervisors. Yes. And I think that'll still be via Zoom, is that right? Yes. For your understanding? Yes. Okay, great. Thank you. Anything you want to add? For those that don't know, Measure S was thought up and created in early 2015, which was almost seven years ago. And so this is an old tax. Seven years in the cannabis world is like 30 years. And so this is time for our supervisors to reevaluate what this tax is for them and for our community. And that's why the voters gave the supervisors the power to amend, reduce, or repeal Measure S. Thank you. Uh -huh. Appreciate that. You're welcome.